rangers often use camera traps. Uh, devices like this, you strap it to a tree and when there's movement in front of the camera, it takes a picture. But uh, rangers have to go to these cameras every six months to replace the batteries and then collect the memory card. And then they can see what is on the photo. So there was an elephant here 12 weeks ago or there was a poacher here 16 weeks ago. And that's when we thought, well, that's something you would want to know in real time, right? You want to know in real time what is going on in your park. So we developed a smart camera system and this is uh, consisting of a camera trap that we modified a little bit so that it can wirelessly talk to our mini computer. And this mini computer downloads the images from the camera and then uses artificial intelligence to automatically classify whether there's an animal, an elephant or a human on the photo. And then we use the satellite modem to send that information through space directly to the phones of rangers within minutes. If you talk about poaching in these national parks, it's literally like finding a needle in a haystack, right? You never know where someone is because these parks are immense, they're huge. So what we hope with this technology is that we, you know, we provide them with some form of hardware in this case that can actually point towards where something is happening. Also, we have developed something uh, completely different, which is a cell phone sensor. And that is used uh, because uh, people, so poachers as well, often carry cell phones with them. And if we can detect cell phones in parks, then also rangers can in real time see where suspicious activi activity might be happening in their park. And, you know, they might act upon it. Yeah, well,